So I have been getting this question a lot lately. What is the best character? Well, so it really comes down to the three mobility kits. Bloxy Boy, Stilts, and Hermes Shoes. There's an exception of Alpha Tester. So let's start off with Stilts. So Stilts basically increases your max speed by 6%, allowing you to outrun some next bots. So you might be wondering why I said some next bots. Well, it has been confirmed that certain next bots move faster than others. A pretty slight difference in speed, but it's not ideal to know that some next bots can outrun you. So this is when the stilts come into play. It allows you to outrun most next bots, which would make this one of the best, if not the best, character in open maps. Definitely a character worth saving up for. Alright, so the next one we have is Bloxy Boy. So the Bloxy Boy allows you to move at a very fast speed. The only problem is its cooldown and the amount of time the acceleration lasts for. However, it is the easiest to obtain out of the three mobility characters since the requirement is only to be level 5. This character works best in small closed maps since when a next bot jump scares you, the acceleration speed boost allows you to get away more easily. Alright, so the last one is Hermes Shoes. Now out of the 3 mobility characters, the Hermes Shoes doesn't actually increase your movement speed. It just increases the time you take to go into the full sprint mode. This could be very useful in maps with a lot of walls. Or if you really suck at the game and you cannot run without banging into a wall, then yeah, this character could be very useful for you. Alright, so which character should you get first? Alright, so it's pretty straightforward. So you would unlock the Bloxy Boy first. So that is the number one thing that you're going to save up for first. And when you're grinding levels for the stilts, you definitely have a lot of excess cash. With the excess cash, you can buy whatever you want to. And when you have saved up enough for the stilts, then be sure to get that. And finally, when you have met the sufficient requirements to buy the Hermes shoes, then feel free to get them. So it really comes down to the map and your playstyle in terms of which character you should use. Anyways, I hope you found this video useful and I'll see you in the next one.